I worked for a manager once who never let me know if I was doing things right or wrong unless I asked or it came time for my review, which I also had to demand. It was a really frustrating experience. During my review, he would say things like, Remember two months ago when you turned that account around? That was really good. Uh, yeah, maybe I remember. Could you be a little bit more nebulous, please? Or he'd say things like, It would have been good if you could have helped mentor some of the junior reps. Okay, well, it would have been good if you would let me know that then. The most important single aspect of feedback is that it is given right away. As soon as you observe something positive, negative, or that needs an adjustment with your salesperson or your team, gather your thoughts and have a meeting as soon as possible. Every minute, hour, or day you delay, the effectiveness of your feedback diminishes. When it's time to give feedback, start uh, something like this and, and do it in private. Graham, can I please give you some feedback on whatever your issue is? Deliver your feedback on what you observed and what you believe should have happened. Then ask, how do you feel about that? And be quiet. If your salesperson wants to improve and become a top selling rep, they will acknowledge the feedback and that will be the end of it. If they do not acknowledge that the feedback you're giving is accurate or correct, then you need to ask why and dig deeper. After the meeting, and this is important, follow up with written notes. Time usually works against the sale. Time always works against the effectiveness of providing feedback.